hurricane. New this morning, experts are now saying your pharmacist might possibly be barred from telling you when you can save money. Cheryl Sutton clues us in on what we need to know. It's a law that gives insurance companies control of what a pharmacist can say to you. It bars pharmacists from telling you if it's cheaper to pay cash for your meds or go through your insurance company. Under this law, health insurance companies enjoy a heftier profit by keeping them quiet. This is something that there's no reason at all that that should exist. Most people don't know. Sometimes it's much cheaper to ask for a cash price instead of just paying the copay. Recently, where a patient, their copayment was going to be $1,300. And she asked, she, she had enough um, knowledge to inquire, how much would it be if I paid cash? It was $40. Congressman Carter is sponsoring the House bill version, and there's also a Senate version. They say it will save millions of Americans money. For example, NBC did a piece that showed that a consumer who had a copay of $43 for a cholesterol drug uh, would have only paid $19 if that consumer had paid out of pocket. I had two drugs. Which one did I want? Uh, one was $86, the other was $5. And I said, well, what's the difference? They said they're identical. And I said, well, I think I'll go with a $5 drug. Well, why couldn't they make that decision for me? Uh, they're not allowed to. President Trump says he supports pharmacists sharing more information with you. And not every prescription drug is cheaper by paying cash, but many common drugs are. Experts recommend calling different pharmacies to see which one has the best price. Time now is a four